Sindel has been restored. Shang Tsung would only undertake such an arduous task if her aid promised a decisive advantage. She is but one mortal. And one of the few who can harm you. I fear no harm. They are at Shang Tsung's island. Your crown. Shang Tsung knows. Then our time for preparation is over. Go to the island now. We cannot win their hearts, so do not try. Do not permit your better nature to compromise you. I understand, Mother. They couldn't go on. I am touched by their devotion. I question their judgment. Have neither of you any compassion? Not for fools who follow you. Are we not following him now? At least we do not follow that fool, Raiden. Then we would surely die. to the void. Not even she can help you. <laughs> I will not fail. 
Nations. Cetrion must be on her way. Simdel and I will occupy her. You two get the crown. I must ask, sorcerer. How long before you betray us? <laughs> I find your lack of faith amusing. When it happens, we will be ready. favor, Fujin, and take one giant step back. You too, sorcerer. Makes sense we'd meet again down here. When you caged me up, beat me within an inch of my life. The hell if I ain't gonna return the favor. Always so generous. Should have fled this fight too. Oh. 
Baker's promises cannot be trusted, Jackson. Bihar, Kano, Shao Kahn. Look at the scoundrels she employs. That's a card you can't play, Fuji. Not when you're buddied up with Shang Tsung. Fight. <laughs> will not heal your wounds, Jackson. Damn it, Fujin. You know what I've suffered. Kronika's my one chance to prevent all that. Not just for me, but for Jackie. For Vera. Shit. You're a god. Ain't no way you get how this feels. You know, the only time Raiden and I ever fought? When I left the Sky Temple to live among humans. Do not become attached to them, Fujin. Sentiment will impede the execution of your duty. But warriors like you and I, we are strengthened by sentiment. We do not fight to kill enemies. We fight to protect our loved ones. That is why it cuts so deeply when we fail. Well, I'll be. Maybe you do get it. Kronika knows your pain. She manipulates you with it. Jacqueline is on her way here. Kronika expects you to fight her. Worse even, break her heart. Is that someone who cares one whit about you or your family? Can you fight? I'll do what I can. Kronika offered the future, but instead you will have none. Blame only yourselves for this fate. Fight!
It is your fate that should concern you, Cetrion. <laughs> Well, Shang Tsung, your strategy proved sound after all. Of course it did. Hands over your head, Shang Tsung! You too, Sindel. That hair so much as twitches. Ease up, baby girl. Dad? How did you get here? We're all on the same side against Kronika. Yes. And now we must bring this to Raiden. Is that a crown? Kronika's crown. Without it, she lacks the power to restart history. About time we had some good news. Now that we have this, we're in uncharted territory. We've changed this timeline for good. Correct. No one can predict what happens next. Not even me. I must return to Outworld to aid Katana Khan. Thank you for aiding us. We will rendezvous at the Sea of Blood in six hours. Until our next battle. Sorcerer. I'll go with the Briggs family to brief the special forces. May the Great Spirit protect you. May she protect you, Fujin, when Raiden lays eyes on you with Shang Tsung. Failure rests on my shoulders. No. I underestimated Shang Tsung's ingenuity. To escape the void. To return from the future. I will face him again, Mother. This time, I will succeed. I must go. With Shang Tsung in possession of the crown, he's become far too dangerous. And I doubt his new allies realize quite how dangerous he is. Your Shaolin masters, they're ready. They will fight until the last man. That is likely what it will take. There will not be a fight if Karon does not help us. Is there any word from Grandmaster Hasashi? No. If we do not hear soon, I will return to the Nether Realm. Wrong Scorpion. This cannot be good. Get Raiden. The Fire Gardens. Rebuilt. The Shirai Ryu are indeed restored. Why are you here, Scorpion? Where is Grandmaster Hasashi? He is dead. And now you have come to finish us. I understand your mistrust, but I am here to assist you. I find that impossible to believe.
What is he doing here? We are not together. If you are here to help, prove it. Join me against the sorcerer. I shall. Fujin? Raiden thought you lost when the timeline was broken, but you stand with Shang Tsung. We have urgent news for Raiden. Please, let us pass. This may be the sorcerer's trick. The Fire Gardens will not be defiled by his presence. <laughs> Why you have joined Shang Tsung is beyond me, Fujin. What has he done to corrupt your mind? Fight. Perhaps listen before you judge. Thank you, Fujin. The storm is not yet past. Shang Tsung! We must speak with you, brother. We, Fujin? Since when are you friends with this filth? I'm here to save you, Raiden. We hail from your tragic future. In it, Liu Kang defeated Kronika, but their battle destroyed her crown. Without this, a broken timeline couldn't be repaired. Our only hope was to return here, steal the crown, and make use of its power. Now we can change the outcome of the fight against Kronika. We can defeat her and fix time. I had never thought you gullible, brother. Shang Tsung's schemes serve only to benefit him. How could you fall for such lies? Be rational, Raiden. Spread your falsehoods elsewhere, sorcerer. You will not deceive us. Lord Raiden, we should listen. He may be telling the truth. There is only one way to find out. <laughs> now, Shang Tsung, the truth! Raiden, stop this! Step aside, Liu Kang. Put down the amulet. Its darkness is taking hold of you. <laughs> you also betray me! This is not the way. Shang Tsung is not the enemy this time. The realms hang in the balance and you form this unholy alliance? <laughs> Enough of this madness. If you both must die, so be it. My brother is my problem. I will signal if I need help. Shinnok's amulet inflames your anger and clouds your judgment. Have faith in me. Fight. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
Listen, brother. We're running out of time. I am a fool. I have allowed myself to become a slave to anger. I will not allow my temper to fracture our resolve further. Surely you jest, Lord Fujin. Not at all, Liu Kang. Raiden's power makes you a fire god. Of course it does. Unfortunately, I cannot transfer my power to Liu Kang yet. First, I must free his revenant from Quan Chi's curse. We will face the revenant soon enough. What else can you tell us about the final battle? We must use every advantage. Enjoying your travels. You have already been defeated once, Kronika. Of course, Fujin. How else could you have escaped the void? If you know this, accept the inevitable. Surrender. But clearly my loss was not your victory, Raiden. If your future savior had gained full control of my hourglass, we would not be here. This timeline would no longer exist. I see no harm in confirming your suspicion. Even if you defeat me, what then? Who claims the hourglass? Surely you realize that Shang Tsung will break your alliance. We are prepared, Kronika. Are you? Have you wondered why Shang Tsung knows so much about my crown? Because he did your bidding, gathering souls to fuel it. Shang Tsung is far too modest. The crown is his design. No one, save me, knows more about its power. Had I told you we would still be marooned at the beginning of time bickering among ourselves? You must decide, Raiden. Who do you wish to keep time for all of creation? Me or Shang Tsung? Neither, Kronika. You will be beaten. And if Shang Tsung betrays us, we will finish him. You are a fool, Raiden. Do not condemn the realms to oblivion. <laughs>
Are you all right? Uh, yes. But the crown. Truly, my finest work. I will instruct you in its ways. What just happened? Kronika came here to retrieve the crown. We forced her to retreat. We must strike while she is weakened. Let us join the armies massing at the Sea of Blood. Together, we will storm Kronika's Isle and take command of the Hourglass. We will rendezvous at the Isle of Kronika. The fools believe victory is at hand. Their misplaced confidence will be their demise. Such a pity my daughter embraces their sentimental values. Having second thoughts in them. Hardly. Katana courts a peasant and obeys the Thunder God. She couldn't be a bigger disappointment. One can only imagine. The Isle. Do not be late. An eternal empire awaits you. Enter. Kitana Khan. Oh, don't be so formal, Mother. You are Khan Kitana. Command the awe of your subjects, even me. Oh, I shall never tire of greeting you. Nor will I tire of calling on you. Our battalion is leaving for the Sea of Blood. Queen Shiva and the Shokan will follow as rear guard. May I request something? Mother, you don't have to... ...make your request. Shiva. Queen Shiva. Risked everything to restore me. Honor demands that I accompany her into battle. Yes, it does. And that display of loyalty is sure to rally the Shokan spirits. Thank you, Kitana Khan. Chamber will heal your wounds. Then we'll discipline Katana and take back our throne. Empress? Tell me I misheard. Tell me you would not betray your daughter. She takes after her father, Shiva. Jared was a weak king. Katana is a weaker Khan. Weak? She defeated Shao Khan. Yet she lacked the resolve to kill him. Now she will learn. Enemies must be crushed, lest they rise again. That was true once, but now there is a better way to lead. Fight! 